No flag for offside. Fowler is able to turn. Sam Kerr couldn't control. Predominantly wide on the left at the World Cup has moved into that more central role where we know she combines very well. Tony Gustafsson up front. The sign from Cooney Cross. In it comes. Milana Kennedy was there. Now has that come off a hand? Well, Milana Kennedy did look convinced. He's asking the question. The ball breezes past the arm of Serena Bolden. Mary Fowler didn't play much last season. It's City as Kerr looking for the glancing header. Caitlin Ford, it's opening up for the shot. It's a long way out. Does really well to get into a good shooting space. It's played long towards Bolden. And if she got a touch on there, I think she was onside with Kerr. Oh, lovely run from Carpenter outside. The cutback. And now Fowler! 15 minutes on the clock, and the Matildas have their early goal, and it's Mary Fowler, she is such a crowd favourite. And she's fired the Tillies in front. Well, what a start for the Matildas, they've been testing early. Oh, she's done well, skipping past Bonta into the area, Randall trying to go with her, the cut back for Kerr! And that's two. The hometown hero. Taking the roof off the stadium at Optus. The Matildas lead the Philippines by two goals to nil. That's a great start from the Matildas. And that's a special finish. Caitlin Ford, the delivery from Steph Tatley to find Ford. But Ford, the architect here, great vision. Finds Sam Kerr on the cutback. The standout hero now, there are, there are heroes all over the park and in all the Matildas shirts we can see around the stadium, like Angie Beard did with the Matildas against her teammates. It's a good ball for Kerr. Again, the flag up, and every one of those flags has been very, very tight. Mary Fowler, you can see Sam Kerr just as lent into, the, into that offside position, but Fowler and Kerr... Hatley again giving the option, it's back out with Gorry. Looks deep, back post, Kerr is there, Razzo as well. Sam Kerr just limp away from the challenge. We know she's had some real calf issues in the 4-0 win. That ball in, it's a good one for Kerr who can control, and that's three! Inside the opening half an hour, Caitlin Ford gets her name on the score sheet. And the Matildas are putting on a demonstration here. Well, as easy as you like for that finish. And it's another tidy one from the Matildas. Yet again, Mary Fowler driving in on her right foot. Caitlin Ford unmarked. There was a couple of shouts for offside, but... Little touch, Razzo now looking to get in on the act. Caitlin Ford, desperation defending from Halley Long to block the shot with space to run into again. For Caitlin Ford, lovely control, 4-0. The Matildas are running them up at Optus Stadium. Hayley Razzo, the provider, and a quick fire double. Two goals in three minutes for Caitlin Ford. Oh, well, the ever-present. We know she can hit them from that kind of range. She might yet have the hat-trick here. Caitlin Ford turning one way, then the other. The chip! Ooh. Not to be sneezed at. Oh, that's a player brimming with confidence. Fowler with the cross. McDaniel coming, Kerr is there. It's going to be a corner. For Caitlin Ford, she's got Razzo outsider on the right. Ford still going one way, then the other. Now Haley Razzo. Flag up for offside. She just hesitated a moment too long to release Caitlin Ford. Ford just held. Well, say so perhaps she didn't. Time of the release. And Matilda's on the charge again. Razzo. She's got Carpenter in the middle. Makes it all the way to the back post with Fowler again. Similar in construction to the opening goal. 
if anyone has the technique to bring that down. Hit that off one, two touches. Elusive trophy. In it comes. Ford's header. Claimed by McDaniel. We talk about quality. Here comes Katrina Gorry looking for Sam Kirk. She might get the ball back again. And we know she loves to strike from distance. We know she can score from distance as well. Razzo a little bit fortunate, perhaps. Oh, here goes Sam Kerr. Through on goal, Kerr. Blasts it into the roof of the net. And did she enjoy that? Did the crowd enjoy that? Australia's all-time leading goal scorer putting the polish on a remarkable first-half performance here at Optus. The Matildas lead the Philippines by five goals to nil for the Philippines, but the 60,000 strong crowd in Perth will have wanted this half to continue for a little longer. It has been great skill for the Philippines to try and turn this one around. They have an absolute mountain to climb, and the Matildas have just made the perfect start to the second half. 25 seconds on the clock as Sam Kerr gets a hat-trick in green and gold. Now by my reckoning, a first hat-trick since the opening match of the Asian Cup last year, where she got five. Here's Fowler now with Kerr, little one-two. Now Kerr has been caught. Lovely little give-and-go play there. Situation again, it's the in-swinger from Cooney Cross, back post. Claire Hunt, header in her Matilda's debut. She's still looking for that first goal. Fowler still, Mary Fowler. One way, then the other. She put two defenders on the ground before just losing her footing herself. Caitlin Ford takes over. Still going, what a run! Brilliant individual goal. Anything you can do, I can do better. Patrick for Caitlin Ford. And the goals just keep coming at Optus. Australia 7, Philippines 0. She's relentless, Caitlin Ford. She's getting the reward, she's so richly deserved. This. That expected a show. As there was almost half a chance, a little opening there to the end of his contract is yet to be seen as Bolden. Spotting Mackenzie Arnold off her line, having robbed Claire Hunt of possession. All women's club in the top fly. Oh, lovely pass. Kerr, the flag's up. It wouldn't have counted. What's well, been a really tough afternoon. You can see on that occasion, Sam Kerr had just stepped into the offside position. Fowler again. Oh, look at the run from Catley into the area, across the face of goal. Courtney Vine sliding in. And she just couldn't get there to the sidelines where Neve Owens is joining us. Neve Carpenter. Little touch. Wheeler trying it. What a goal from Claire Wheeler. Her first ever international strike. And it's one for the picture book. Brilliant strike from the edge of the area. And each goal comes into the game. The move taken short, Catley as Carpenter gets the ball in, say up with the foul. Delightful ball from Van Egmond to break the line and find the oncoming run of Carpenter and Sayer was just half a second late to that challenge. McDaniel had hands on the ball and Catley's ball, the head up, just over. Well, it was right into the perfect area. Confident to meet the ball. Just hasn't quite over that delivery. Against the Matildas. Catley, in it comes again, the head up. Just time to run well. The applause in anticipation for the final whistle. There it goes. 
The Matildas knew they had a job to do here in qualifying on the road towards Paris 2024.